What do you think of how the president did and specifically how your constituents are going to view that and what it might mean for you? I, I think Coloradans love the president's optimism. That's what we are as Westerners. I think they liked his uh, discussion of opportunity. He said opportunity is who we are. In particular, if you think about uh, Colorado, when he said when women succeed, America succeeds, you could hear a lot of applause uh, coming from Colorado. So it's, it's, it was the, a Colorado kind of speech tonight is what it was. Senator, you have made no secret of the fact that you are uh, annoyed, to say the least, about the problems with Obamacare and specifically how much that has made your life more difficult as somebody on the ballot this year. What did you think about the speech and how that might have helped or not? Yeah, I've said, look, uh, why didn't you implement this? Why didn't you get ahead of it? Uh, saying sorry isn't enough. So my approach is let's make this new health care law work for Colorado. We can't go back. The old system wasn't working. I thought the president leavened it with a little bit of humor tonight, but he made it clear. If you've got ideas, uh, and we all do, let's, let's improve uh, the health care system in our country. When we do, we lift everybody. To have Americans who don't have health care hurts our economy, of course, hurts those families and hurts those individuals. So by, by what he said tonight, did he go far enough, or do you think he needed to go further for your for your taste, or more specifically for your reelection promises? Well, when it when it comes to Colorado, we've got to make this law work, and I'm going to continue pushing the president to make some additional changes to look at extending the individual market time frame so you can sign up over the next couple of years. There's some things we can do. Saying sorry isn't enough. We is he, make this is he a liability for you, the president back home? I, when the president comes to Colorado and talks about our all of the above energy approach, we've got lots of natural gas and solar power. Uh, it, that resonates with Colorado. When he talks about making sure our veterans are treated properly, that resonates Does with Does that Colorado. mean you're going to campaign with him or you're going to have him campaign with you side by side? We're, we're going to be uh, running a strong campaign based on Colorado's uh, interests and Colorado's future. My job, I think, is to protect Colorado's way of life. We've got a wonderful way of life. That was not a yes or no. Yes or no. We'll see what the president's schedule is. We'll see what my schedule is. But the Coloradans are going to reelect me based on my record, not the president's record, not what the president's done, but what I've done and how I've stood up for Colorado. That's the case I'm going to make to Coloradans. Wow. One more chance. You're not going to say yes or no, are you? We'll see what the schedule allows. <laughs> I'm running for the I election, not the president in Colorado. Well, if I think